Oh yeah. This is where I had to go to get my CD from. But as you see, it's kind of thick though. But, uh, first one, bam. Got it, man. Logic, standard version. Like I said, I will get. This shit was crazy, man. We went to fucking so many goddamn cities to find this shit. We went to one mall. Thought they had an FYE store there, but they fucking didn't anymore. And then we called a different store. It was sold out at that FYE store in the same city, Modesto. But at both fucking stores, they were sold out. So at that point, I kind of said fuck it and gave up after uh, I got my TI CD. So I was like, I ain't tripping. And I got TI from like the same spot. And we ended up going to the first Rasputin's, which is in the Bay Area. And they didn't have it. I really said fuck it. And then we ended up going to the one in uh, Stockton and they actually had it. Kind of a plain CD. Damn. This nigga put any thought into this shit? So, like I said, I got the standard version. It was kind of expensive at Rasputin's though. Shit, they wanted damn near $20 for the deluxe version. I only got like pictures of them and shit. But for everybody saying that this album is not tight, this album dope. I don't care what nobody say. And yeah, I still pick this nigga above Rat Pack right there, J. Cole. In my personal opinion, he's above J. Cole to me. But we'll see what J. Cole do when he drops his album, man. But I was going to rent if I didn't get the CD, boy. I was going to be mad as a motherfucker, though. So I'm actually glad I got it, man. A new CD for the new collection. I'm working on a new collection now. My old CD book is filled up. So definitely, man. Logic with his debut album, Under Pressure. Definitely dope. He definitely need to come back next year, you know, with, a, with another album. Definitely, since he got so many songs. But let me know if y'all picked it up, if you had trouble finding it. What did you think of, you know, the packaging? And if you didn't pick it up, would you pick it up? Because it's already number one on iTunes. And what do y'all think he would sell the first week? That's another interesting question. I think he should do pretty good, but that's just me. All right, y'all, I'm out.